For the CircuitPython Parsec today, I just wanted to show you how to hook up the seed round display to your Cutie Pie and use it inside of CircuitPython. So this is a really cool new display from Seed, designed for the Zhao, but the Cutie Pie is compatible. Uh, it has a lot of neat features, particularly this round TFT display here. Now it uses a particular chip and it has a particular pinout which are not readily available or obvious on the internet. So I did a little bit of searching around uh, and I came up with a formula that worked. Uh, in, in fact, someone in the uh, Adafruit forums pointed out the pinout that would work for this. Uh, and I might create a, uh, a little document for it that makes it a little easier to find. Um, but here's how this works. So you can see I've got some sample code that is the GC9A01. That's the driver chip. Hello circles.py example from Toddbot, who was fooling around with these kinds of displays a few years ago. You can see this is from 2021. And I've got this running with a Cutie Pie RP2040. Now, the original pinout that Todd had used is still uh, listed here for the Cutie Pie RP2040. He also had code to take care of some other Cutie Pies, but since that's the one I'm using, I just left that code in there. Uh, and this is just simply a case of it is uh, hardwired on this display because you push the little Cutie Pie right down into the headers there, uh, and you've got to use the pins that they want you to use. So here they are for the TFT DC we use pin A3, for the chip select A1, and for the backlight it is TX. Now those pins can go by other names, but I stuck with this convention here since those are the names that are on the silk screen on the Cutie Pie. And then the rest of this code here you can see we've got the SPI set up on the TFT clock and TFT MOSI, and then we're using the four wire display I.O. display bus using those pins that have been selected there. Uh, and I'm using no reset, uh, so you can see that's just set to none. And then we have the setup of the board. Display equals GC9A01, GC9A01 display bus, and then the width and height, even though it's not a square, it pretends sort of like it's a square 240 by 240. Uh, and then we use the uh, modern display IO group display root group equals main to set up that display. And then the rest of this is just some cool code that Todd came up with to uh, use essentially a sine and a cosine for X and Y so that we could move this little text object in a circle very neatly, as well as create some other little uh, circles that are moving around with some randomized positions and randomized colors. And so that is how you can use a Cutie Pie RP2040 with the Xiao round display from Seed Studios. And that is your CircuitPython Parsec, Parsec, Parsec. <laughs>